Hi, good afternoon. My name's Eric. I'm an industrial designer. I'm currently in my fourth year at UNSW. This is my design, Hijack. So it's a telescopic hydraulic jack with a low profile. Came across the idea when I researched the topic area of earthquakes and the rescue surfaces that come after an earthquake. So with buildings, when they collapse, there's a lot of rubble displaced along everywhere. I watched a video on the Chinese earthquakes actually, and then they, they had a person stuck underneath the rubble for 36 hours and all of the devices that they had could not fit underneath to jack up the rubble to uh, get the person out basically. So that was the biggest problem, not being able to fit the existing devices, the existing jacks to be able to raise the rubble. So with my design, it's collapsible so it has a lower profile to up to 100 mils. It actually is powered by a hydraulic pump so you can fit it onto existing hydraulic pumps that you might have available from the rescue services and then it will jack up. That's in its highest height at the moment. So special features about the design is you can use it on uneven surfaces. The reason why is you've got stabilizing arms on the end, so you've got three stabilizing arms. With the existing jacks, if you use them on uneven surfaces, you will actually wear out the cylinders really quickly if you have a heavy load on them and it won't be as stable as well. Also, this is a telescopic jack and with the existing telescopic cylinders, they tend to get smaller as they go higher with the existing designs. So with my one, I've kept the same surface area on the top and bottom, and that's just to keep stability. So once you raise up the rubble up to a certain height, you can then use the existing jacks to rescue the person out. I've also done a bit of research as well on ergonomics on the human head height, and it should fit the 95th percentile of human heads, so you can actually just pull them out.